nonprofit government watchdog group called OpenTheBooks.com, and they've now found the city of Nashville will spend seven thousand dollars a month to a private company for Metro Police to use 97 parking spots. Joining us live right now is Deputy Policy Director, uh, Editor rather, Rachel O'Brien, to talk a little bit about the impact of this. Okay, Rachel, $7,000 a month that they're paying to essentially rent parking spaces for Metro PD. Why do they need those spots to begin with? So these are for the police headquarters. Um, there's apparently not enough parking spots. Police have been leasing these parking spots, which are right down the road from the police headquarters. Um, these are the new headquarters that opened in 2019. Apparently, they simply don't have enough parking. So for years, they've been renting these spots from a private company, Jocelyn and Sun Sign, um, which is a, a pretty well-known company and Jocelyn himself is, is pretty um, active in local politics. So the company was charging Metro $4,000 a month, which is a pretty hefty price tag for 97 parking spots. Now that figure was raised to $7,000 a month for a three-year lease. That's a $108,000 increase over those three years. Okay, why? Why did they nearly double what they're charging Metro? Right. So that was a question that a few of the council members asked. Metro Council had to vote to approve this new lease, which they did do. Um, and Council Member Berkeley Allen and Bob Mendez, they both asked that same question. So a, a lawyer from Metro explained at the meeting that the old lease expired. Uh, Metro didn't sign a new one quickly enough and that the business owner, Robert Jocelyn, is simply raising the rate. This was the rate that he was going to allow Metro to use these spots for. He did not answer our questions. We called and emailed him and Metro officials also didn't explain why they allowed the old lease to expire. Yeah, it, it sounds to me like uh, more questions need to be asked as to how you get away with. And listen, we all know that property values in Nashville are, th are through the roof, uh, but how they get away with nearly doubling that price uh, right at the last minute. Okay, Rachel O'Brien, thanks for your work. By the way, if you want to read more about it, we've got this posted at our website, fox17.com.